Well, I think there's enough responsibility to go around, but the spike in the ages from 25 to 34 uh, really coincided with the state's opening up of, of bars in, uh, in our area and clearly throughout the state. So, you, so you're blaming the, the so, governor? I'm not blaming. Uh, we've, we've got a, a spike that we are dealing with, and uh, we promptly put a mask order for our area, the city of Tampa, in place. And as I'm sure you're aware, the research shows that, uh, you know, if everyone wore a mask for two weeks, we could cut down 80 percent on this uh, on this virus. And so we've had great adherence to that mask order. We've actually passed out over 200,000 a mask since this this past Saturday. Are you considering closing the bars and our businesses already, like restaurants, closing themselves because of the, the rising case numbers? We have had a couple of restaurants close, but we had, uh, you know, we have great weather down here. And so what we did in the very beginning when restaurants started to open slowly at 50 percent capacity, we did a program called Lift Up Local. And we actually closed down streets and allowed the restaurants to move tables uh, outside in, in uh, roadways and sidewalks and other locations. It's difficult to do with the bars. The governor has advised that the statewide alcohol uh, enforcement agency will be suspending liquor licenses on the spot if bars are found to be in violation of uh, the restrictions that have been put in place. Mayor, what do you make of the uh, new measures announced uh, today by uh, Governor Cuomo uh, about uh, requiring a quarantine for 14 days uh, for, for individuals that travel from <laughs> your state. Is that something you can understand, given the, the differing infection rates, or, or do you feel like it's a little unfair, a little anti-American even? Well, actually, our governor did the same thing for individuals that were coming from New York. Uh, I, I look at it more from a, a position of effectiveness. Uh, you know, you just stop someone and, and give them a, a piece of paper that says quarantine yourself for 14 days, and you have to, you know, count on those individuals for doing that. So, uh, you know, the governors take the steps that they feel necessary, and I'm doing what I can locally to, to protect our community. Madam Mayor, you, you now have the goat of football uh, playing for you, Tom Brady. Are you, are you ever going to be able to host a game where the fans can see him before we get a vaccine? I, you know, I don't have the answer to that. What I do have the answer to is that we are hosting the Super Bowl come February, and we will be the, the first host to hoist the Lombardi Trophy as a hometown winner of the Super Bowl. So that I'm looking very forward to. A oh, strong, uh, strong conviction there. Big prediction. <laughs> Mayor, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you very much. I appreciate it.